The state medical examiner's autopsy into Freddie Gray's death revealed that officers placed him on a metal bench in the back of the van following his arrest, but he was not restrained. During a second stop on Baker Street, Gray was removed from the van and placed in ankle cuffs before being slid onto the floor of the van. The medical examiner surmised that Gray may have gotten to his feet at some point during the journey and was thrown into the wall during an abrupt change in direction sometime between the second and fourth stops. Gray was found lying belly down on the floor while facing the cabin compartment by an assisting officer who then placed him on the bench. Police picked up a second arrestee at a fifth stop where Gray was found unresponsive and kneeling on the floor facing the front of the van and slumped over to his right against the bench. The medical examiner concluded that Gray suffered a severe spinal injury to the lower left part of his head.